what is going on guys quality xa here today and today i'm bringing you guys a brand new video on sea of thieves now before we actually get into this video we are bringing you guys a sponsorship which is absolutely awesome now before we get into the sponsorship you guys must know that i will not take any offers anything like that if i didn't think that they were a great idea so this is an app known as amino now, Amino is an absolutely awesome app which actually allows you to join a mobile network of communities for every interest that you guys can imagine. This, from video games such as Call of Duty to video games such as Sea of Thieves, you can join these communities and it's not just them. You can join communities for movies, for TV shows, all of that good stuff. Now, the brilliant thing about this is it is very interactive. You can do things such as have text, voice and avatar chat which is really awesome i actually posted on a poll where you could actually vote on what the best weapon was i thought it was a really good idea so if you guys wanted to check that poll out then please do it is obviously about what gun is the best so it should be pretty easy to find you can also do things such as joining challenges or events what i'm actually hosting or other people and as well as that, there is actually challenges and questions. Now, I actually done a quiz. My highest score was actually 16 on it. So I got every single question right. So I don't know whether you guys will actually be able to beat me. But let me know what your highest score was on this quiz that I actually took. It's a very awesome app indeed. And just a great way to have a small community like the Sea of Thieves interact with each other, talk to each other. And it's just a great way of meeting new friendly faces, posting memes into chats and joining awesome chat rooms. But yes, guys, I'd highly recommend joining this. You guys can actually follow me in the link in the description is actually a join Amino link. So it'd be awesome if you guys could go and check that out as well as following me. My name is Quality XA and I will leave that in the description as well. But yes, guys, some awesome things with this app. Now moving on to the video. Now before we actually get into the main video itself, I do want to write a disclaimer and say everything what is featured in this video is in the rare art book what you guys can pick up for Sea of Thieves. It is also to note everything that I am featuring has actually been data mined out and is actually in the game file. So everything you do see today has a high possibility of actually coming in the game at any point in time. So do keep your eyes peeled. But like I said, this has been data mined in the past. Every single thing that I will show you. So starting off with what could possibly be brand new enemies or brand new pets. So we actually have here bats, rats, as well as brand new skeletons. The skeletons look like boars, chickens, cats, as well as lambs or goats by the look of it. The enemies obviously potentially being the skeletons as well as the bats and rats. So very awesome indeed. I definitely wouldn't be liking to get into a fight with any of these. You've also got skeleton fish as well by the looks of it. So expect more things other than the shark to attack you in the sea. Moving on now to the next enemy is actually these brand new mermaids. Now the mermaids have been confirmed to be coming in the next DLC. And you guys can actually see that these look pretty darn vicious, especially the one on the right with the orange glowy eyes. He's also got the captain hooks as well, and I definitely wouldn't like one of these chasing me. Also, we have got the new events coming out where the chests are actually going to be underwater. So I can imagine mermaids and things such as that actually guarding these chests. But it'll be very interesting to see and really cannot wait for these enemies to come into the game. Now moving on to what I can only describe as pets or possible merchant stuff. So, first off, we actually have crabs. Now, the crab has actually been described as a source of food in the game files, as well as that it has also actually been described as selling to a merchant. But then there has also been some rumours going around that you can actually have a crab pet. Pretty darn awesome indeed. You can also see the different colours of him there. We also do have this page here, which shows us the boar, the cat, the chickens and goats as well. Now these are confirmed as pets. We do also know that you can actually get a monkey as well as a cat, which has been spoken about before by the developers, which is pretty darn awesome. And then we do also have these fish as well. So the fish, I'm not too sure if these could be pets, but they may just be friendly creatures or again, a source of food. We do know that there are going to be more fruits as well as different stuff introduced into the game. And then last but not least regarding the pets, my personal favourite, we have the parrot. 
Now it's not 100% confirmed the parrot unfortunately, but it's definitely the most realistic because you can imagine having the parrot as more of a cosmetic item where it would sit on your shoulder and just make sounds or do different stuff such as find messages in a bottle or different types of treasure that you wouldn't normally see. I just think that that's one of the better things what a parrot could potentially do, but we'll just have to wait and see what Rare actually does with the current items and current things what they are going to be putting in the future of Sea of Thieves. Now moving on we're actually going to be talking about new ship designs as well as new ship figureheads and sails. Now I'm just going to let them roll in the background but you guys may have recognised that one of the figureheads is actually currently been put into the game and it was actually only put in recently for the Pirate Legends. Now what it is is the unicorn but when you actually reach Pirate Legend you will have the ability to actually buy this ship. Now this sort of hints towards why I believe these will be featured in the game at some point soon, purely because Rare has released some of them already, which is pretty awesome, and some of the stuff is just too good to not feature. Why would this all be in the art book, and why would they release some of it, but not all of it? It doesn't make sense, and like I said, this is all data mine what I'm showing you today, so more reason to believe that this is actually coming into the game. We do also have this really cool thing what I wanted to show you in the underneath of the ship. Now I don't know whether this will actually be customizable at some point in time. I really hope that it will purely because I will definitely customize the bottom of the ship. But you can see just the different designs what they actually have and some of them do look pretty darn awesome indeed. And then a couple more things that I did want to show you guys before we end this video. One of them is actually this pirate smoking a pipe. Now I highly doubt that this is going to be coming in the game as a cosmetic. Purely because Rare wouldn't want to promote smoking in their game. But regardless if it did ever come into the game it would be pretty awesome. Because again it is another piece of cosmetic which does look pretty decent. But again we need stuff which progresses us. And then last but not least for the art book, I did want to show you this really awesome page here, which could be a hint to the first DLC, which actually looks like some mermaids just staring into your soul at a shipwreck. It looks unbelievable and definitely pretty scary if these are some of the mermaids which we will encounter. We do also have this Xbox, what I wanted to show you, which was actually released at PAX. It looks pretty darn awesome, and I definitely know that I would actually want this Xbox are you a big fan of Sea of Thieves that you would actually purchase this Xbox? Let me know in that comment section below. And then before we end this video, I just wanted to show you one more thing known as the Xbox One X marks the spot. So this is arriving in stores this May and you actually unlock a free exclusive Sea of Thieves in-game items and a chance to win an Xbox One on every pack. Now these are the Chips Ahoy. Now I don't actually know where these are actually from but I do need to pick up a few of them. So if you guys could let me know if you guys are in America let's say or Canada. If you see them tell me because I don't believe they're in the UK. I could be wrong about that but please let me know because I am looking to get a few codes just to see what the in-game items are. But yes guys that's pretty much the video. If you enjoyed please do smash that like button. Don't forget to check out the app Amino and as always peace out. And I hope you enjoyed.